Hi, I'm Rachel Hensley, Relationship Editor, editor at I Am Magazine. This is the fourth week of my series of getting healthier and things like that. This is my almost third week at the gym. And I lost 1.5 pounds this week, which I'm completely excited about, but I'm really not going to focus on pounds in general. Right now, I'm focused on the way I feel, the way my body feels, how my clothes are changing. I bought this a couple weeks ago, and it's already starting to get loose, um, and it was kind of tight when I bought it. So that was, you know, a big thing. Like, my whole wardrobe is starting to, I'm able to tell the difference in, like, inches and stuff just from the little bit that I've been working out. Um, I haven't really changed anything in my diet, and I have enjoyed some, you know, Christmas treats, and uh, you know, within reason, and just working on portion control. But the way I feel is absolutely amazing. I have worked so hard at the gym, but the mental clarity that it has given me, the energy that it's given me, um, the confidence that it has given me is worth every 4 a.m. alarm. So getting up in the morning I thought would be so hard, but now the problem is, is I'm starting to wake up every day at 4 a.m. So on those days I'll just go ahead and do my workout at home. And you know, as I get more used to this, I may end up going to do more time at the gym, but just some cardio and things like that in between. But right now I feel great, and I hope that um, you guys are doing good too. I hope that you are trying to maintain through the Christmas holidays and things like that. And I so appreciate your support. Like all the messages, texts, uh, Facebook messages, and just those messages of support saying, hey, you know, I'm so happy for you. Keep going. That keeps me motivated. Having that accountability has really helped me maintain. This is the longest I've stuck with Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday at the gym and really not made any excuses and just gone and not thought anything about it. There's days that I'm still sore, but as far as my joints go, where I have lupus, I usually have a lot of pain. And right now I'm able to work out not as much pain. I'm able to do all the things that, you know, before I couldn't do because I'm um, with uh, Brett Lee's at work out any time. He is helping me to strengthen my joints, strengthen my body so that I can prepare my body for more exercise and more things like, um, more cardio, um, more weightlifting. And this week it was great because I got up to 45 minutes on the elliptical, which was a big deal for me. And I, my legs felt like jello when I got off for just a brief moment, but I was fine. And I'm actually not very sore today. And I was figuring that I would not be able to move after I got out of, um, or after I got out of bed today. And I feel really good. So I am a little bit tired this week because Christmas just kind of wears you down trying to get everything ready. I hope that you have a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and enjoy your family and friends. And please continue to support, you know, be there for me. I need you guys. I really need that, um, that little pep talk or saying, hey, you know, keep going. I was like, it so helps me. And I hope that you guys are doing great. Stay focused. It's going to, you're going to feel so much better once you do. Um, I know it's working for me. So you guys take care until next week. And soon we'll be doing our... 30 day of seeing how much uh, fat I've lost and things like that. So I'm so excited about that. But take care. Happy holidays. Bye. Your body's in a chair across from me. But your mind is in the sky above. The trees just floating So lonely yeah. You tell me that you love me truthfully But empty words have got no use for me So show me Just show me yeah. Well your shirt is all stained from the heart on your sleeve You talk a good game and I wanna believe i
Buried deep inside 